at Michael's. It was nine and change, and then you can get those coupons all the time, the 50% off, the 40% off, whatever it is. So, let's see the little tag. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, so this is it won't matter because it's going to get tucked into the side of the So, and I'm going to fold it one more time because I don't need it to be that wide. And then what I want to do is, so this is probably going to be the last time I reuse the same grapevine tree because you really have to push this into it and kind of open it up and pull it. So I think I'm gonna be able to take it apart afterwards and reuse it again, which is fine, because they're not that expensive. All right, so you can kind of see what I'm doing. I stuck it in the back over here and I'll re-stick it in when I'm done too so it's a little bit more secure. You can always use some hot glue on the back of it. I feel bad because it's the flag, but to get it to stay. And then you're gonna come up here and twist it and then pull it around. And then this extra piece is gonna come up behind it, so it's gonna be a lot more secure. All right, so that's it all twisted together. And I'm gonna put the bow right there. Okay, so that's with the bow. And if you guys have any questions on how to make the bow, if you watch the one where I did the spring wreath where I made it, I give you like step-by-step -step instructions. If you have any questions, just ask. I can, you know, find a, um, like more of a diagram and I can send that to you guys. But it's fairly easy. So just play around with it until you kind of get the shape that you want and kind of like the angles and stuff that you like. This is what I like. And now I'm going to add the greens to it. All right, so these are the greens I took out of the other wreath. And I'm just gonna put them underneath to give it just a little bit of something else, a little more of like a texture. This is slightly different than the one I did for my aunt because I used different different greens. Um, I did hers at like the end of the summer for like Labor Day. So there's different, different types of greenery out there. But this is essentially... It's just gonna be like you just gotta practice and you just gotta take them out, put them back in, type of thing. I don't know if I'm put this outside or not yet. That will be decided. Oh, the weather gets better. I feel bad sticking the American flag outside when it's been nothing but rain. It's just one of those things. You know, you're taught to respect the flag, so. Yeah. That's it. That's the finished product. I wish the bow was just a little bit more full than it is, but it does the trick considering to update this for the 4th of July. It was five dollars. I used everything in the first wreath but bought the flag. So if you have any questions, let me know. If not, have a blessed day.